Hello, howdy doody. Um, been away for a few days, uh, back on now, doing a little bit of the Avengers, as you can see. Um, done most of the single player now, a bit of a pain, um, to be fair, but uh, let's pop into um, some gameplay show. So we won't do that, we'll go into the initiative. This is loads of things we can do in here. It's a fun game, you can play as the Avengers. It's it's like the Avengers, but um, I don't know. They've been uh, demoted in their powers because the Avengers wouldn't take as much of a beating as they do in this game, that's for sure. Um, I've got up to a decent level now, so 130. Um, with an extra couple to make my... Uh... Oh, we've got skills. Um, so let's have a thing. I've only got one skill, so just any other quiz can be boring for you. Um, a mastery, I probably should be doing. See, I don't use that shield. Use the shield champion, I can't do until I'm a little bit higher. So, don't use repulses and then dodging back to fight. Yeah, it just it does buy it. Just have to remember to use these things. Okay, objective. This is kind of thing that I was looking at. So, taking aim. Is the masks mission? This is the one I really wanted to do. So the inhuman sanctuary. Here we go. Day of remains mission. Day of remains mission. Um. Let's see if I've done any of the side quests. No, not you. Actually, no. Let's just go straight up and let's just do the. Uh, Table. Here we go. Remains, wasn't it? Which could be there are these ticking away. That's the one, isn't it? They remains. Okay. Yeah, it's an interest, interesting game. It's a bit like Destiny and matching other things and mix and match of other other things who have we got um me i'm tony stark unless you've never seen the uh, the avengers so that's me and my tron outfit i've got cap i don't really want cap um get rid of you 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 so i like these guys their play styles it works with mine Launch mission. All right, Hank, what's this about a new mech? We've been hearing whispers about an experimental dread bot. My team just found the facility where they're being made. It's still early in the process, so we think you can intercept the plans before these things go into production. Send us the coordinates. Ready, Stretchy? Heck yeah. Let's go nab some blueprints. Stretchy's not with us. Some of my people are waiting at the rendezvous point, but there's been a new development. That's never good. They've spotted watchdogs in the area rounding up inhumans. I know it's not what we came here for, but the blueprints can wait. No question. We'll meet up with you guys on the ground. See if you can okay, find those inhumans. Working on it now. The watchdogs are getting more powerful, aren't they? Seems like they're everywhere. Nobody's trying to stop them, except us. But you know that's a pretty big us, so I think we've got a chance. Totally. Let's fly through. Looking for boxes, you see. The, the bit that's like Destiny is you have to keep picking up gear, leveling gear up, etc. And these boxes can often give you something. Here we go. All the way around. In fact, yes, I need to do my my uh, screen bounds are slightly off. Can I do my buttons, close caption, subtitles, graphics, gameplay? 
camera controls had UI. Hmm. It's not in there. So it's slightly not right, the game bounds, but hey, come on. How did the watchdogs know to look here? These aren't their usual stopping grounds. AIM has a couple caches around here. The Inhumans could have been spotted on their way through. Just gonna go around them a little bit just to have a look. Out of bounds. There they are. Pim scene. I'm guessing that's not a campfire. Rockets. Friendlies. Just gonna go over the other side as well. I like to scout out the whole area. Sometimes you find a, a weapons cache or something. And sometimes not. There's a chesticle there. Anymore? No, I think that's it. Okay. Back to the mission. People. So, everything's on fire. Did we expect everything to be on fire? I don't think so. Good, good. Just checking. Oh, there's a cache. See that um, little um, ping on the high left? Wouldn't want to be in your shoes. Running down now, 70, 60. Appears to be an old shield cache close to your location. Clearly. Can I still shoot it if they're good guys? So in a minute you'll see a little ping on the ground, a little circle, and a noise. Ping. Here we go, a little circle and a noise. It's pretty cool. So this will open the ground up by actually press and hold it. Oh, it opened up. Here it is, opening up now on the ground. So we go down here and we'll find a couple of boxes and we will get a location of an actual patch. And that will be on the map um, when we go back and choose missions. We can choose the, uh, the map. Um, and it's a... It's a bit like this, you go into a bunker and you have to fight your way down and you have to open up a certain part of the the bunker, you know, like four times. And you're attacked each time. It's like you're inputting a code, really. Oh, nice bit of golden gear. Um, so, yeah, so this is something you can find. Just That's why I go wandering. Um, I think that's all that's in here. I hope. Um, yeah, so there's nothing in there. We've done that box. In that box. Let's have a look. Nothing in here. Box. Nothing to break. The stairs that we came in. Come in. Do a ping, you know, usual ping up to see. Not showing anything, so uh, we've got everything we came for here. Right, now we can go back to the actual main mission. There's 
I come back and out quickly have a look at what gear I just got. So we got some new gauntlets. Let's have a look at some of these now. Okay, repulsive attack bit and these are repulsive. Um, missile attack, jammer. Delete that one because it's very silly. This one, laser. I don't use lasers. Laser attacks are these. Missile attacks deal plasma damage. Laser attacks deal plasma. So that one. Also attacks to jammer. Also attacks. Yeah, I just got rid of something. I didn't want to get rid of missile attacks to gamma, which we've got. Missile attacks to plasma. So keep those. Sweet. And then we jump to the next one. No, I think that was that one. Here we go. So melee. Light attacks trigger burst of shock damage. I think I've got that light attacks, light combos yet. That was similar, so we'll get rid of that because you will run out of space with these things, which is something you don't really want to do. Um, light attacks do cryo damage. Ten percent of laser attacks just don't use lasers. Heavy combo light attacks by. Why not? Laser attacks again. Keep that for now. Although they the same thing. No. Signature attacks. Keep that. Keep that for now. Yep. Think we've got much in there. Okay, I believe that's where it is for now. Go over here and help these guys. Made it. How are we doing, Hank? Sounds like gunfire in the forest. The Inhumans are holed up in an old bunker, but. Watchdogs are closing in. All right, you all stay back. We'll head in and send the Inhumans your way. Got it. Be careful in there. Looks like AIM gifted their friends some new toys. Oh, nice. What kind of toys are we talking? I'm guessing big, explodey fire ones. Good guess. Up, up and away. We need to get those inhumans before the watchdogs do. There is a special enemy unit close to your location. They may drop something useful if defeated. Okay, less talky, more fighting. You got it. kill the big guy. Up, whatever that was. Ooh, four out of five stars. Where's the telling me to go? Did you hit? You can fight your way all the way through, but uh We need to smash these doors. Smash the doors. Hmm. 
I'm just chilling some my big, big coke. One open. Buy some rockets off. Mute everything around. Smash this side door. Do my last rockets before I run out of power. There we go. I've just got to secure the area, so he's got to kill everything now. The good guys, don't shoot the good guys. Waiting down the road. They'll get you somewhere safe. Thank you. All right, come on, let's go. Watchdogs aren't happy. Reinforcements headed your way. We'll cover your exit. Go. If you hurry, you can ambush the watchdogs oh, before they get to down here. Better jet. Oh, testicle. Always, always good. Right, let's have a quick clutches at what we uh, require. See if there's anything else. Another one. Oh, there's quite a few things around here. I wouldn't have seen that. I just thought that maybe some Please enemy would come out of there. Blockade on the road. Another one. We'll break through. Nice. It's always nice to when you find goodies, isn't it? Especially in games like this. Oh, is this the? Could be another shield bunker. That's what this is. Might have even been not the one we already emptied. Is it? Right, so very, very quickly, very, very quickly. That's a new one. So, signature attacks do particle damage. Combo finishes, yeah. Let's get rid of that one. And so that one is an empty shield. We'll just set that one up so we get rid of that. Okay, and then that one is new as well pretty great chance for light combos takedowns yeah i've already got something very very similar this is that one um they don't have in fact these guys don't have any um like uh special intrinsic stuff which is what i want so i want the i want it to have an extra damage perk of some sort And then these guys. Yep, okay. There is the door. The inhumans are safe for now. You've done a good job keeping the watchdogs. <laughs> <That's weird>. So <laughs> thanks for that. Well, yeah. Uh you're welcome. Oh, anything that was. We found it, it's alright, it's alright. Don't don't call for help, we're fine. Right, there we go. So I really like playing um Iron Man, you can play obviously all the Avengers. They all have different things. I just like being a distance. It's almost like the sniper class of this game. <laughs> really. Onto him. Hey, watchdog! You looking for us? Capture the Avengers. I don't think so. You want to protect these monsters? You could die like one. Yeah, I can lock on him. Maybe he was just too far away. Keep his shield down. Just slowly pop. One, one down. No one else falls. You got it. 
There is a chest with special resources close to your location. Oh, there's a chesticle. There's a chesticle in there. Do these guys first then. Oh, ouchie. And there are lots of little one line quips and this kind of stuff in this game. They do get repetitive, but it's still in the still in the, the vein of, of um of these guys. Hmm. That's 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 not there. So these um chests. Let's see we've got something in here. Oh no, it's just here. I thought I had to make my way. Sometimes there's like a code you have to do, which is just standing on plates and stuff like that. It's falling down there. Oh, I can't get it. So that's out of bounds. Okay. Doesn't matter. It's what it is. The big guys rather than the, the little guys from now. Stop that shot. Stand up and fight! Forget the weak! Did that hurt? Ooh, did that hurt? That looked like it hurt. Oh, we've got flame boys. So I'm gonna land down here. Pop my little shield up. Yeah, I'm giving him gamma damage as well, you see. That's why I want to get that chest, not the chest piece, though, yeah. Chest piece, I want to get something that's got some extra damage on it, like shark or... Plasma or gamma. We found what set the forest on Oop, chesticles is in there. So you guys okay? It's closer to you than it cans. is. We need some time Turrets. to get everyone aboard the Quinjet. That we can do. So this building on. here, and oops, <laughs> moving more to cool? you know what, you yeah. spent too much time with Nat. I am cool. So if I go near it, it's on fire. And I'm gonna oh, and I'm uncool? I can see what I've got to do. You see that there? I've got to shoot those. No. To find them, to know where they all are, if I push, see, I've got lines coming out closer. You see golden lines, oh, come on, cheek. So I can see two I need to hit there, and there's going to be two on this other side. Not showing up, come up close enough. Pretty sure. There's only two. There's only two. Oh, no, there's three there. And we're fire up ahead. That's fun. We'll hit that one. Hit that one. Blue and blue. Hit that one. Not, not green. There's one more left. I don't know where it is. There it is. You have to hit four, and then it turns green. And Lots of smoke. Be the door down here. You can now open it. So it tells you above the door. So down below, it will show that there's four things you have to hit because there'll be four kind of golden buttons that you need. So. See above the door, those four circles. That tells you those four things that you need to hit. And to, you find those by pressing the up button. Oops, screw that up. So you push up on the D-pad and it will show you the either lines saying that's where you need to go. And it will show you on the ground. It gives me a chance to show you again. So yeah, you've got the lines, golden lines on the floors. 
and it tells you you can see the kind of very subtle lines going up on the left hand side showing you roughly where you need to go to open the doors and whenever you hear Jarvis say there is a, a crate with blah 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 in your vicinity just have a look around and you'll see this little logo it's above the crate and you'll get your gear and this like I said before is very similar to Destiny and the other games um, where you have your gear so your gear that and obviously your artifacts all those things together give you your your power and your your power level up here is kind of your light level you know an equivalent of of the destiny power level and then you've got your basic level your basic level is kind of where your unlocks come in and every time you you get one more basic level you get a skill point and as always you've got all these things that you can use um for your your uh your character so they all have their own little different different um abilities and you know as as uh as avengers they all have their own intrinsic um skills so whether they're in humans and like the hulk and not the boy is he inhuman or did he no he just kind of irradiated himself didn't he um but yeah the the inhuman side of it uh they have their own that you can push um i've got the hulk buster is if you remember the iron man suit that looks like the hulk uh that's like my super so again the same as destiny you press and hold a right and left bumper and you perform your super so the hulk does a like a, a flam you know big uh, flappy hands bang and makes a big pressure wave and that that's his kind of super um i've got a roaming super so again speaking as if i'm playing destiny i do this and i i've got a big suit on around me what we realized yesterday i did it by mistake playing the single player is if i press and hold right bump if you just press them together bang you enter the suit so the suit kind of appears around you if you press and hold it the hulk buster appears translucent a meter or so away from you and, and anyone in your team uh the ai won't do it but any human you, that you're playing with they can enter it so we we had yesterday we had the hulk get inside the hulk buster go in do his pew 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 with the hulk buster and smash 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 then leave that and he's still that side it was quite funny we should have streamed it but it was it was too late uh but we'll do it again at some point i'm sure we'll we'll stream but yeah what's really nice about that again i found it by accident if i just read what it said as you can read the script in front of you it tells you there quite clearly that you could do this i don't i don't read stuff i just play in pew if it works i keep doing that if it doesn't i'll try something else until i figured it out myself but if most normal people would just just read that um so it says at the bottom alternatively hold left right bumper and use um the right stick to position it then release it and you remotely place a whole buster deployment platform once deployed any strike team member can utilize the platform to a quick hulk buster armor and yeah we put the hulk inside it and it was quite funny um so yeah very useful um i i really like playing tony stark and iron man as i said because of the range I can sit back and I've got my um, my my rockets. So you have got the primary. So you have your melee, which is generic. You know, you just when you're up close. You then got your repulsors, your lasers, and your rockets. And the rockets, because they lock on, um, and because of the armor that I've got, which is, is it this one. No. Nope missiles missiles um the gamma warhead the piece of gear i picked up gives me the, the the gamma damage to my rocket so you'll see the little green kind of numbers coming off so it just adds another uh damage element which is kind of what i want to i want to get that in something else as well this is reduces gamma damage from you know someone's attacking me with gamma um parrying incoming attacks grant intrinsic bursts don't parry that much um so at the minute i have got um if i 13 14 percent chance if someone hits me they they float off the floor for a little bit um and the chance when critically injured i grant a big in intrinsic burst and i've got fire damage so the intrinsic burst is kind of your super 
So you'll see on the bottom right, I mean, you might not see because my logo is in the way. But um, if I come out here, you can, yeah, you, you're just missing one. So the one that's behind my Cupid logo is my right bumper. And, and that's his chest. So if you remember, Tony Stark has his power supply. I'm sure there's a proper name for that. Um, in his chest, and he can fire out a burst. So I've got three little bursts that I've chosen. You can have one big burst, but I've gone for three little bursts. The big circle at the top, you know, the one that's the light spinning around it, that's my super. I call it a super. It's probably not. That's my heroic something or other. That's my uh, Hulkbuster. And then on the bottom left, the one that's not quite full yet, is um, an ability that means that I can fire my rockets really fast. Because normally you have a cooldown. You fire a rocket three or four times. And you have to wait a few seconds before you can fire another one. That kind of overcharges you. There you go. There she goes. Um, that overcharges you so you can fire a lot faster and a lot more rockets. But what it also does now is it puts up a bubble, you know, like a Titan bubble in, in Destiny. Um, and that shocks people coming in. They can't fire rockets in for a few seconds. And it's quite useful. So I do... I do like that. Okay. Let's get on. And you can see I've got a golden bar at the top um, with with my little um, Iron Man facing it. That's kind of the amount of energy I have. So if I fire that off, I'm overcharged now. You can see the two lines either side. And I can just fire loads of rockets while it's overcharged and I don't get a cooldown. It won't last very long. There you go, it's stopped now. And now as I fire, you'll see each one I fire takes a bit of that um, golden bar away until I get to nothing. I do that. And now I can't fire. Wait, let me fire. Let me fire. Because I've got nothing left and now I just have to wait for it to charge up. I've got a few perks on now um, that mean that charge is pretty quick. Um... So that's the basics of, of this game, really, when it comes to... And that's the same with all the characters. They have the same reduction in that um, in that bar at the top as they're fighting. Which is why I like to be at distance. So it's, it's actually quite nice. Um, I can sit back slightly. Oh, and there's another little chesticle there. The resources you need to upgrade, you know, um, as usual. Nothing else in there. And also what's nice is, single player wise, your characters, the other characters are heroes, the Resistance Avengers, they teleport with you. So if you get somewhere really fast like this, they'll just appear around me. So you can kind of miss out a lot of the ads. See if there's any testicles, there is one down there. There you go, they've trans teleported to me. Let's see if there's anything over here. Person locked in there, so we can undo that. We can get them out. So I got a critical hit on that guy, which is why I got a burst of, of kind of golden orange. And that's me. Um, the armor perk. How do we get in here? This might be one of those things. Oh, Christ. You surprised me. Hulk turret. I mean, I think Hulk just took that out. Another one there. Golden boy. Let me get this guy out. Or person. Yeah, there's a chest in there. I don't want the chest. I wonder why well, I do want the chest, but I want to get them out. I've seen this one before. Let me come back a little bit. Nothing's glowing up to say I need to unlock a certain thing. 
Let's see if I can just send him here to smash. Uh, there is a goalie. Gold. Tell Hulk to smash that, see if he can. Yep. Get Hulk to smash that, see if he can. You smash that? No. Maybe this is part of the story. I might be being really dumb here. Normally, if I do that, it tells me that where the trigger is. Okay. I've got my slight damage resistance to fire, so these guys aren't as bad to me. So I'm just going to do my bubble. Fire more rockets off quickly. Yeah, we've got a shield down. So all the, the main thing with these guys is that blue shield they have around them. If you can get that down quick. Okay. One. I'm just going to wait for my little golden bar, as you can see. Put him back up. Chucking fire at me. I'm going to get that use that tree as defense. The problem is, because I'm fine, my guys won't go in and fight, so I kind of have to go get above his head. Now my guys will get a bit closer and hopefully do a bit of damage. But if I drop down and put a bubble up, The other guy should come in, and we're protected inside my bubble slightly. Well, there we go. Better get those inhumans out of here. Tim, you are clear for takeoff. Almost there, guys. Just one more. The last mission coming. Damn, I didn't rescue the other person. Then there must have been a way to get them out. Unless, well, no, there's a chest chest in there, so there must have been a way in. He <laughs> hoped up and down deep. Humans are on their way to the ant hill now. Oh, I've got loads of stuff. Anytime, Dr. Pym. Sorry we couldn't get those blueprints for you. Speaking of, Jarvis, uploading now, sir. You uploading think? now, sir. Why don't you tell me? You're welcome. Enjoy your Dreadbot blueprints. Bye now. So the mission chain it continues. So quest really continues. So if we go into a character, we have a skill point. I'm going to wait to do that. Objectives, we should find. Hawkeyes. Oh, heroes. Did we finish it? Inhuman Sanctuary. No, we didn't. So, completely. Oh, no, we have done it. So, complete the Desert Vault Elite. So, the Sanctuary missions are done. Okay. Um, complete the Desert Vault Elite and the Turbulence Elite. Okay. So I think we've already done the Desert Vault Elite once. So. It's a gauntlet. So now let me go back and... Track, well, I can't track that. Okay.
Hey, hope we get that for now. Get that for now. Um, have a look at what else we can do. This, that is for the story, but I, I might do the vaults with my buddy later. I think he needs to do them as well. We do a little bit of um, the Wakanda, uh, but that means I'm not playing as my uh, my favorite character. Um, complete any war zone with at least one other player in your strike team. Okay, and the Seas, Living Sector, Cosmic Threat. Beating the odds. Could do that one. Do that one. There's another player to play that one. Turning around, complete any sabotage mission. Can I just play with that? Okay. Okay, Desert Vault Elite. It is ready. Yeah, screw that. Let's do that. Let's do that one. Yeah. We will either really do it or we'll, we'll die a lot and then uh, we're going to do something else. Um, select my heroes. Yep, those two guys are fine. Greetings, Avengers. Resistance Intel has identified the location of another shield vault. AIM appears to be in the area, likely seeking the same thing. Find the vault and recover its resources before our enemies have a chance to find it. And one, one tip. Um, I'll wait till we go in. Well, anyway, the, the, the level progression of your character, so to get good gear, I found that if you start this mission, or any of the vault missions, really, I've not done many, I've only done one elite one, which was this one, I think, you, um... I don't have the exact location of the vault. Your signal detector should pick up a shield frequency when you get close to its location. Scout out the area ahead of you to locate it. So like before, when I found the other one, you'll see on the top left that little ping and a distance, and then you'll use that to work out the direction you need to go. Um, that's what will happen later on. But you start this kind of mission off. You look around, and you see if there are any uh, crates. Search through this area to find the location of the vault. Your signal detector should pick up its frequency. So we've got one over here. I found that the this might just be bullshit, so don't take my word for it. But what I found was I got much better gear by doing this elite run than I had done previously out of normal crates. So you can do this, find two or three crates. You can even go all the way and get into the vault and open the, the crates in the vault and then start again. And then start again and then start again and you get all these crates. You just, you know, you refresh the... Uh, And you press your ping. Oh, easy, tiger. Self-destructing on me. Oh, and you as well. Petty, aren't they? But yeah, you can press your ping. And with that, if you don't move, you can look around. And if there are any crates, they will show up. That's really are a bit on the, the touch side, aren't they? Something I haven't worked out properly yet, and it's probably a very obvious thing, but I don't know how you get your health back. I just keep smacking stuff, and every so often I'm like, oh, my health's back. So I should really pay attention to to that. Just doing a ping to see if it shows any crates. Vault, you should scout the nearby area. to the designated location so you can see now on the top left i have got a uh, 
a radar ping. But there will be testicles around. The signal detector picks up the vault frequency. Follow it to reach the vault location. Don't these guys ever learn? I'm just going to fly around and see if I see any crates pop up. Turret over there. There is a chest with gear close by. There's a chest with gear close by. Is that on this side? Because normally it shows you a little logo of the chest. You probably just missed it. Look for a chest with gear nearby. Yeah, I am looking for a chest with gear nearby, but I'm not seeing oh there it is. So you see, they're not actually um inside something you can just find them so this is a really good easy tiger get my box and the punch and the open are the same button so you'll do a lot of punching when you try and open a chest so this is a really good way of leveling up i found um just do this open all the chesticles that you can see around um and yeah and then you just restart the the mission and they will be there again. Any more chests? I think there are. Okay. I think this is part of the one of the missions. Have a quick look to see if there's anything here to pick up. I don't think there is. No. So, let's have a look at this radar. Well, there's a chesticle just there. Did miss it. But again. Right. Shoot at me. I think it's around because it's, it's saying that it's over there. So, but I think we have to go around this cavern, cavern, ravine, potentially. Let's go here. And to the right. Yes, I'm pretty sure it's this way. And then oh, there's a big, there is big a fella. Aim unit near you. Defeat them, and you may gain something useful. Chest. My heroic overload is, is there. I'm gonna go down. Oh, I got injured. I'm injured again. Just gonna pop my bubble. And my health is back. So I think it's damage. I think I get health back by doing damage to things. Thing to pick up. So I need to find my. I need to go in here just in case of the chesticle. I probably wonder why I call them chesticles. It's just something we, we called them a long time ago when we were doing the other channel. And it's just stuck. Whatever game we're playing, if there's anything like this, yeah, they're just chesticles. 
just pathetic childhood, uh, childish, even um, immaturity. That's all it is. Go through here. More. Oh, that's closed up. It has to be oh, over here then. The well, this is the uh, rail yard thing that, is, that we did. Um, story. Go yeah, there's a down there. And there are going to be locks to open on this. So I can kind of see now. Guys, don't just turn around and you can see people to fight. I'm down. The, the AI in this game, I've got to say, are dumb as fudge. Avenges my ass. Okay. So. Just the one. I think that's all I've got to do. Yeah, there's only one that time. Sometimes there's obviously a lot more. But that was just a single lock, so just one thing to view. The DNA key, I don't have a DNA key. So you pick those up or you buy them, I think. Right, let's have a quick look at what we've got. So, quite a few new things. So at the minute, I have got. Melees can give a charge burst and light combos trigger a shock burst or electricity. Light combos finish attacks with gamma radiation. Brilliant. That would work hand in hand with my rockets. Increase critical hit damage from mid air melee attacks. Don't really do many mid air, but I do some. 16% chance. 16% chance. Increase critical attack damage from all weapons. See, that's very, very good. But that is also hold to hold A to lock. So that's locked. That's equipped. Okay, so that's locked. Light combos been heard. Increased supercharged energy. So we're going to keep that one as well. Signature attacks. Increased chance light combo will trigger stun damage or explosion. Signature attacks. I don't really do signature attacks. Light attacks apply plasma damage. Yes. 37 mana grants intrinsic. Yes. Rate of fire of all weapons. Yes. So we'll keep that one. Get rid of that one for now. You're probably bored, but I'm going to have to go through this at some point, so I might as well do it now. Signature attacks deal. Um, combo, heroic charge. No. Um, supercharged energy, so that's the same as that one. Increase recharge, right? Increase supercharged energy. No, it's not. We're going to keep that. Right, single chance, cryo chance, damage debuff, increase critical chance for all weapons. Okay, yeah, that's a good one as well. Okay, and then finally. Yes, so they're they're good. Next, Ugh. start from this end. Chance powered range, chance ranged power attacks grant a damage buff. Missile attacks deal plasma. I think we already looked at this one, and we'll lock that one. Plasma could be better. So, chance range powers and defeating an enemy with a range critical attack grants heroic. That's the same as that one. Okay. Unlock gear. So, I, okay, I have to do that and that. Now I'm going to lock it. But I can't equip it if it's locked. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to use this. Um, and I'm going to lock that one. 
Uh, like laser attacks, no, I don't use lasers. Um, missile attacks deal plasma damage, physical hit, heavy combo. Finish. I don't really use heavy combo. I'm not going to delete it, but I'm not going to lock it. 20% laser attacks. Also attacks, not use them. Also attacks. Missile attacks do gamma. 23%. Block that just for now. And that's my shield one. I think that's a posh one, isn't it? Chance of weak point anti gravity missile payload that causes nearby images to float in the air. I'm going to lock that one. Okay, again, this is super boring for you, but <laughs> I need to do this. Otherwise, I'm going to delete stuff I really need. Uh, uh, reduction. So we'll, we'll keep that because that's a gamma reduction. Cryo reduction. Energy cost for generating an energy shield. I don't do the energy shield. Uh, chance of critically injured interest burst. Yes. Damage gamma. Yes. Perfect evading triggers anti. That could be useful because I do do more of evading close quarters. So we'll lock that one as well. Chance of a group of teammate grants willpower. Chance of perfect evading grants intrinsic burst could be useful. Armored when in proximity to other teammates. Fuck yes. Um, fully full chance powering air incoming damage. Already got gamma. Chance of rubbing teammate damage reduction while aiming, possible. Chance of parrying will power burst. Yeah, not amazing. Damage reduced from Cryro. I think we've already got. Oh, no, we haven't. Yes, we have. That's what we've got on now. Fire damage result. Yeah, resistance. Damage reduced while overcharged. Ooh, okay. We'll get rid of that one. And we'll keep that one. Okay, and then almost finally, <laughs> 11 increased critical hit for a light combo. Chance of activating assault grants heroic charge burst for all heroes. Increased charge rate of heroic. Yeah, maybe. Let's hold that for now. I increased stun damage from sprint and dodge attacks. Don't really do those. Don't really use that. Um, Increased critical hit chance from mid-air melees, increased rate heroic ability and chance defeating an enemy grants a willpower burst. Stun damage from sprint, I just don't do those dodges. Increased rate of ability by 17. Get rid of that one. Keep that one. Now these artifacts. So Human Alliance XP, so we'll lock that. Increase chance to receive bonus ISO 8 charge when completing drop zones. We'll hold, keep that one. This is what I'm using in a minute. So extra fraction stuff. These are all 30s now, so that's good. Reduce damage from all gamma damage attacks. We'll hold that one. We'll have another one, so damage from shock. And damage from plasma. So they're they're just intrinsic useful useful in their own way. Support ability. Um, okay, we'll hold that because that's another damage resist. Spin attacks, I remember Joel, my mate, was moaning about those. So, broke support by 9.2, broke support by 7. Damage reduction from Graviton, as I said, we've got that one locked already. Increase range, so we'll save that one. And what's this one? Mission at Challenge 2 rating or higher will award extra gear items. Ooh, harsh. That is that could be useful because I'm gonna just about to do that. So 
So I need to just level this up two more. I'm going to lock that one. So this is good because most of the stuff I do now is um, a challenge two rating. So there we go. That's. Can I? I haven't got any more stuff to, to raise that one up. But and we have got skills. One. I'm going to hold off on the skills because I'm pretty happy with, with what I'm doing. Oh, jeez. Right, boys. Sorry. Sorry. I was indulging. Okay. Just, just trying to run away to find my. This way, this way, this way. It's, it's inside here. I'm pretty sure we have to go through to the other side. This is green. No, because it's green because I bloody opened it up. Easy. So we need to get to another area. This I'm gonna die in a minute. Is this a cave that we can go through? That's where we've just been. Nope, this is where we need to go. There's a chesticle. Any contacts around? Doesn't look like it. Yeah there is. Don't 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 no 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 no. Oh damn it, I'm down. I use one of my lives up, which is a bit silly. But anyway, th that was kind of the point I was trying to make was if you can get all these chests before you even get inside um, the uh, the actual vault that this mission is all about, up ahead. you're all good. You can just do that, repeat that, repeat that, repeat that, um, and you'll level up really quick, kind of what I did. It's probably going to be down there, isn't it? And then we're going down this way. We're gonna get there. We go. It's gonna be on the ground just here. A resistance ally is in trouble nearby and needs your help. Oh, well, I'm sorry, but we're busy. Although I could just open this thing up and then go and help him. Oh, no. Come on, help. Do your job. There we go, there it is. Just gonna put that up just to protect me. Hold this. You have discovered the location of the shield vault. Please step inside and take the elevator down. I have used up a life stupidly. I wasn't paying attention. But I think I think if I do die and it's a wipe i think we wipe and start this last sector again so i don't think it's too much of a big deal years alone on the chimera and you didn't see them ever the stack of headshots all signed that was hours of work man but yeah i do like this suit like, like as always you can in most games you can go to them the old marketplace and just buy this is just something i i bought i was bored and i just yeah there's loads of things that you can buy um you go to your couch and go to outfits you can see everything that's available so there's kind of some cool there's a lava one that i thought was kind of cool this one there I thought that was kind of cool. It's like the original uh, suit, but with a lava coating, you got a cosmic one like that. It's quite cool. But I went for the Tron because why not? Looking for crates. Again, it's just good to, to level up. I'm pretty happy. I think I've pretty much got what, what I want. Um, 
smashing these up to get some of the resources. So yeah, you'll see now that we have a lock to um, uh, to decode, and we just have to pretty much go and stand on numbers um, as we get attacked. So you can see there's, it says shield, and there's what five squares underneath it or rectangles. And on this side, there'll be numbers, and those numbers represent these things over here. So I'm just going to look at the numbers so I can roughly see where I am. So this one is two, 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 five, one. One, two, five is that side. One, two, five is there. The rest is on the other side. So one, two, five. Okay. One, two, five. One, two, five. The vault remains intact. Code so three and five, so three's got to be this side. Three, so stand on this, code and then go to five. So. As you can see, I've got a timer. So now we have to stand on the square in front of this door and get attacked and just wait on that door until an EMP burst happens and we have to do this two more times. So we do it three in total. So we stand here. I'm going to tell my guys to roughly stand here. They won't. There should be enemies spawning, but there aren't. Yes, they are. As long as I stay on this, they can get up close and personal. Down if it lets me. Just, just let me do a thing. Almost finished. Doing the shuffle. So it's finished so they don't get hurt. But now an EMP will happen because we've got to 100%. Kills everything. I'm just hopefully I've got my, my health back. So one. Two five, one two five is on the right. So now four one two. So four is this side and one two is the other side. So four four and then one two is the other side. Code verification entry verified. One is to the right. I don't think this is one. So And then we'll do the defense on the thing. And then we'll do one more time and when it'll be longer code. Wait to be attacked. The last time my bubble just didn't come up. Should help. I'm same with my big Hulk for the last um, phase. I can stand on here, right, you know, and survive. Yes. The hell hit me? Is someone invisible? I don't know. Almost. Thank you guys. So yeah, we've survived that. So I've got my big Hulk. Um, my health is so good. So low. So low. Ooh. 
Una mas. One more. One more, and I'm going to get some food, actually. So we'll get this vault, and then I'll call it a day for now. So we need one, four, two, five. So one was this one. That one's two. So remember, that one's two. Yeah, I've got a time limit, but I think it resets to 45 seconds each time. So you really shouldn't struggle um, with this. And I just recommend going around before you start it and work out what numbers are on one side. And as long as you know where three of them are, you, that's it. The rest is pretty obvious. Now we stand on here. We'll do the same again. Hopefully my barrier is back. Right, Hulk, what are you looking at? You know, chill. Chill, mate. Get me rockets ready. This doesn't seem like heroic, though, to me. So. There's a hacker, so we have to go and find out where the hacker goes. So we'll go to one of the... He's over there. So that's all good. I'm gonna hulk. I'm gonna hulk. I'm just do my rockets. It should hold them off long enough. And that's it. So that's it. That's a lot. I'm just going to go around and make sure I pick up anything that's been dropped. So that's a vault. Or a cache. Or a cache. Or whatever else you want to call it. Um, so this is where you get, again, some good gear. It's a good way of leveling up your characters. These are all your resources that you'll do. There's normally two chests in here at least so you've got three now three so one either side and then your main chest excuse me excuse me thought excuse me thought see the punch pressing hold it and you still punch right so now let's have a quick look at what what we've picked up See if it's any better or worse than anything that we've had before. Stop. Have a look. So, two new ones. We have got chance combo, charge jet, light combos, or your wave of pin particles. So I don't think I've got a pin particle one yet, have I? No. So I'm gonna. No, I'm not. I'm gonna save that one. And then. Signature attacks deal, shock damage. I'm going to get rid of that because I don't do signatures that often. Um, your new laser attacks and bin. Don't do lasers and this one. Increase critical hit chance for power attacks. Enemy, so defeating enemies, heroic charge. 10% for heroic charge. Get rid of that one. So 10% heroic charge, 20% gene. No, so that one's that one's still much, much better for me. Um I'm gonna I'm gonna save that one just for now. And I've got some new ones to go in here. So one more. Increases the rate of heroic assault by seven point eight. I'm sure I've got one higher than that. Support 
for oh no I don't no I don't I need to go to oops I need to finish this first I need to go to the the, the equivalent of the tower in Destiny, which is the um, the, the the carrier, um, and we have a a vault in there, so we have a place that we can we can leave certain items. Um, that was the elite. I didn't feel like the elite. Um, I'm sure last time I was getting attacked whilst doing the codes, you know, whilst going around doing the numbers. I'm pretty sure I got attacked doing that on the elite but hey excellent work avengers with this vault recovered we've bolstered our resources and are one step closer to fully rebuilding shield our agents in the field will continue searching for more hidden vaults as this certainly wasn't the last one no it was not no 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 so heli carrier you see heli carrier double to the outpost which is the chimera and that's where my vault is my my wardrobe that I can put stuff in, um, which I will do now. I will just so I've got space on my character. So here we are. So that's the water. This is where we do all the missions and stuff. That's the that's the global map where everything um, is in here. This is the science lab, techno lab where I can make stuff. I haven't got in, enough things to make. Um, this is where I can, can change characters to be different people. Um, Romanov, Banner, Thor, I must be upstairs. Yep, this is me. So if I go in here, pretty sure this is where it is. I've never actually used it. Joel showed me. No, it's not in here. You cheat in one chair race and they steal your wheel. Almost time to restock this thing. Okay. Yeah, no, it's not in here. It's in... Could be the science room. Science room. Here. Yeah, it's in here. This is... We'll go in here and then I now go to gear gear loadout can I store it I'm just gonna unlock it and see if I have to unlock it to store it ah yes transfer transfer sensor inventory lock okay so I have to unlock everything that's a little bit silly I'd like to be able to have it unlocked. You know, so you should be able to transfer. It should be a mark and go, I don't want to delete this. That's all I want to say is don't delete this. Okay, and then this... go I can always come back here once uh, I know what kind of uh, what mission that we're going to do and then you know pick and choose I'm just happy I've got a decent range of things now although I'm st I'm sure you can get higher light um, higher light higher power level stuff um, Actually, I am going to go and get my rocket one back. Um, yeah, I will.
Graviton damage, shock damage. Plasma damage. So I will transfer that one. Heroic supply one. And that one. Right. So what did I want to get back? I wanted to get my rock my gamma damage. Yes. Move to hero. Okay. Plasma damage, move to hero. Okay, so let's have a quick butchers and see what we've got on here. So, plasma and shock damage. And block. I could have done this after I quit because I'm going to quit and get some food now. I should have done. But hey, look, you get you get to hear me just talking crap while I go through all this. Um, but there we go. It's a bit of an introduction into into the play style of this game for me and my Tron outfit, which is which is which is damn damn cool. Um, yes, and that's it. I'll be back on in a little bit. I am sure I'll probably do some more um, Far Cry because. People have been enjoying those videos, so I might do that. Uh, otherwise, I'll be doing some random Avengers or some other stuff. I've got a booster on. I've got a weak booster. Not a weak booster, like a not very strong booster, but a week-long, a seven-day booster on this character. So that's why I'm playing a bit more um, than I normally would. Um, but anyway, thank you for watching. Um, and, and yeah, I will be uh, back on a little bit after I've got some food. Okay. Um, and as always... Look after yourselves and be kind. Be good to yourself. Goodbye.